say the suspect spotted the teenager standing on a street in Flushing, Queens. And the apparent motive for the attack wasn't to wear the stolen sneakers, but to sell them. CBS 2's Mark Liverman has more. Watch closely. It happened fast. A Queens teenager seen here on his phone. A white car slowly drove up next to him. They pull over, and that's when these three suspects make their move, tackling him down onto the sidewalk. The victim struggling while being held. His shoes ripped right off his feet. The kid was just standing there. He didn't do anything wrong to anybody, you know? Just minding his business. Within seconds, the suspects are off with his wallet and shoes and back in the car. The victim helplessly chasing after them. I couldn't believe what happened to that kid. He was just standing there, you know, shouldn't have happened to him. I feel bad for the kid. The victim taken to Flushing Hospital with cuts to his knees and arms. But the story doesn't end there. The suspects are caught on camera again, this time trying to sell the shoes. Walking into Image Sneakers on Northern Boulevard in Flushing, Queens, David was at the register. He didn't want to give his last name. They weren't nervous. They, you know, they weren't stuttering or anything or anything like that. I just thought they belonged to one of the kids. I didn't know that they were stolen at the, at the time. The trio negotiated with David, but in the end, he didn't buy them. This particular pair of shoes, brand new, usually cost between $1,500 and $2,000. The reason they didn't buy theirs, they were knockoffs. That's right, the sneakers they stole were fake, whether the crooks knew that or not. If the kids feel like that's their way of getting a quick buck, then, you know, it obviously happens. And it's something David says happens way too often, but not today, not at his store, not in the four years he's worked there. In Flushing, Queens, Mark Liverman, CBS 2 News. And police say the victim, a teenager, only had a debit card and $10 in his wallet.